Stock IQ uh, lives in the cloud, but it can be equally deployed uh, on premise, operates in a browser. We're going to integrate into the ERP system to pull in relevant data to do planning. This information consists of things like the item master, the open supply. It'll consist of all open customer orders, sales history. This type of information is what is driving Stock IQ and are for our primary objectives. Our supply chain planning suite is delivering inventory planning, forecasting and demand planning, replenishment planning, and supplier monitoring. If we look at our four keys, here on the home screen, you'll notice that we also have dashboards that provide information. These dashboards are driven by various alerts and the inventory positions that we're seeing inside of the data that we've evaluated. Uh, for example, as you're noticing out in here, out of stock, what am I out of stock on? A click of a button allows us to drill directly into the stock outs. This will identify where we're stocked out. and We also put priorities on them. Furthermore, we've set up views in here or have the ability to set up views that gives us visibility to just the information that I'm looking at. So for instance, as we're moving from that dashboard, if I only want to look at my AB based items, uh, I have the ability to filter those out. This information is what's popping up in my report. I now have the ability to save that report out in here, AB stockouts. So one of uh, Stock IQ's big focuses out in here is to provide that information in the form of the dashboard and provide the ability to drill directly in to begin investigating. So as we start talking about Stock IQ's core functionality, as to other, other relevant information so that we can get into a collaborative planning and forecasting type process, events and promotions.